<clears throat> still waiting for the grouse. And of course, since I had nothing to do, I watched the last video. <laughs> what a trip. <laughs> I can't believe I'm funny. It's really cool to watch. <clears throat> it keeps me from being bored. That's right. Entertain yourself. Self-entertainment. Video yourself and then watch it. You'll have yourself in the stitches. <laughs> Is it okay to laugh at yourself? I mean, I laugh at myself all the time. I laugh at everybody else, too. But usually not, so that they know. Unless it's Willem. He's used to it. He is. And he laughs at me, too. He laughs with me. It's quite cool to have an entertainment center right in your own camera. You can just watch it and be entertained. Here comes a bird. A crow. The blackbirds all flock together. Do you know the blackbirds, the red-winged blackbirds, they say, Koila and they're usually near water. But the crows and other blackbirds, maybe not the crows, but the other blackbirds fly with them. So you have regular blackbirds and you have red-winged blackbirds. And I don't know if you live somewhere that doesn't have those kinds, I don't know what you've got. But, and this time of year, they seem to be the first birds back, the red-winged blackbirds. That's when I know it's actually going to be spring. It's not a matter of the weather. But when the red-winged blackbirds come back, they know. Hey, you know what they found? Scientific studies have shown. Now, I know that's a, that's a word filled with trouble right there. But um, they found that, that a bird's eye can see the magnetic rays. You know how the Earth is surrounded by the magnetic field? Like the um, northern lights and stuff? All that's the magnets coming off of, from, from the north? We see them here. I love them. But anyway, I haven't seen any for a while. That's why I didn't video them. But I don't suppose I could video them anyway. Oh yeah, I did see them one night in the teepee. Okay. So the magnets, the magnetic things go all around the earth. And birds can see that. Their eyes can detect that. I don't know how they studied a bird's eye. And how they did that. But they found out that a bird can see the magnetic field. And they follow specific magnet lines. That's how they migrate. Isn't that cool? So can butterflies do that? Is that how butterflies go from Canada to the mountain in Mexico? At Angangueo? Anguangueo. El Rosario. I was there on top of the mountain with the butterflies. That was very interesting. Never would have thought I would ever be there. It's not a place I would ever go. Just like I'll never go to Dubai. But I went. I did actually go. Of course it was on somebody else's dollar. As a travel writer. That was very nice. Very interesting. Okay, this grouse is not making noise and my feet are starting to hurt. All this weight on my feet, you know. It's a lot to ask your feet to do, to hold all this weight up. Okay, should we give up? Are you a quitter? Sometimes quitting is a good thing. When your intelligence overrules your desire, you can say yes. It's a good time to stop. My time could be spent better somewhere else. However, I'm already this far. I've already waited this long. He's only going to make noise sooner than later. Unless he's close to me and then forget it. I've wrecked it all. All right. Bye.